Hello everyone, welcome to today's tutorial, where I'll guide you through the process of creating and importing an HTTP custom cloud config link. But before we dive in, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our helpful tutorials in the future. Step 1. Install HTTP Custom To get started, head over to your mobile app store, search for the HTTP Custom app, and install it. Once it's installed, go ahead and launch the app. Step 2. Set up your config file. Upon launching, you'll find yourself on the home screen. Now it's time to set up your config file. In my case, I'll be using a UDP config file. Step 3. Save your config. Click on the plus icon, then select the Save Config label. Give your config file a name and save it. Step 4. Install Google Drive. Next, let's upload the config file to the cloud. We'll use Google Drive for this step, so make sure to install and launch the Google Drive app. Step 5. Access Google Drive. Once you're on the Google Drive home screen, click on the plus icon to proceed. Step 6. Upload your config file. Click on the Upload label to upload the config file you created. You can find the file in the HTTP custom folder. Step 7. Edit visibility settings. Once the file is uploaded, it's essential to adjust its visibility settings. To do this, click on the three dots located in the top right corner of the file. Step 8. Manage access. A menu with various options will appear. Select and click on the Manage Access label to proceed. Step 9. Change General Settings. Now, change the General Access Settings to Restricted to Public, so that anyone with the link can use the Cloud Config link. Step 10. Copy the Public link. Copy the Public link of the config file, then open Notepad to edit it. You can follow along with the video on the screen to ensure you create a valid link. Once edited, Copy the link. Step 11. Back to HTTP Custom. Now, go back to the HTTP Custom app and click on the hamburger icon to proceed. Step 12. Use Short URL Maker. Select Short URL Maker, and a box will pop up. Paste the edited link into the box and click on the Generate Label to create your HTTP Custom Cloud Config link. Step 13. Copy the Cloud Config link. Once the Cloud Config link is generated, copy it. Then, click on the plus icon button and select Cloud Config. A box will pop up. Paste the Cloud Config link to import it. Step 14. Connect VPN. Now that the file is imported, click on the Start button to connect to the VPN. And there you have it. You've successfully created and imported your HTTP Custom Cloud Config link. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more informative content. Thanks for watching.